Right now, as Baylor's head coach, that's a line drive kickoff, top of your screen, right above where the score and time is, and Griffin will throw on the opening play from scrimmage. And sideline to get the play. Fake to Finley, and out on the flat, this is Kendall Wright with the first down and plenty. That's a backwards pass caught at the 35-yard line by Ernest Smith. Because they may snap it like they just did. Looking downfield for the first time today and briefly open and caught. And this is Finley busting through and he's hit hard, breaks through the tackle and gets inside. Griffin, this is Finley, race to the corner of the end zone. He cuts back and cuts right. Chance to throw perhaps. And instead it's going to be a sack. Remember Griffin, very dangerous when he runs, and when he throws. Sideline, and it's a touchdown. The PAT is up and good. Gibbons in deep formation, and this kick will wobble to an up man. They get to the 18-yard line, and a little open to his left. Opportunity here for Wake Forest to get great field position. This formation, JC. Is this game on in black and white? <laughs> That's Brown right there. And you can take a look at the lineups up at the top of the screen as Wake Forest will. And all sorts of misdirection and a little hole. Now a more standard formation there. And flags are down for the first time this afternoon. So on third and long, Skinner in some trouble. And look out behind him. His pass is deflected and intercepted by Taylor. Griffin he finds the open receiver at the 44. That's Geddes who caught the touchdown. Two new tackles out there. That's quickly into open space with Wright. He's going to try to make something. Still haven't seen Griffin run. Penalty here on Baylor. Plenty of time and open in the flat. Sideline. You saw the coordinator, Brad Lambert, for Wake Forest. Bryles calls the plays for Baylor. Griffin's first run. He is hit pretty quickly in the country. He'll lead block and everybody get out of the way. And he's wide open there for a second. There wasn't a wake to. And Griffin on the keeper gets away. And he will pop a first. On the pitch, this is Finley. And good pursuit that time by the Demon Deacon. And we have whistles. Full start, 74. Of a bruising in this one, the ACC, of course. Griffin fade pat into the end zone, and, and that is going to be incomplete. They go underneath to Salubi, and he will. Much with a different formation, this kickoff hooking out of bounds, and they're going to get great field position here again. Well, free kick out of bounds. With Brown in motion, and he gets the football, and will get a solid five. Fakes it to Brown that time. Second handoff coming all game, and nothing. Skinner down he goes. More pressure up the middle this time, and Skinner, Chris Burke, in single safety formation. Pretty good kick. Burke gets by the first, and the second, tonight on our family of networks. Salubi in a tailback and has the ball for the Baylor Bears. Maybe not. 20. Really working on containing Griffin as he heaves it down the field, and it is going to be incomplete. Now towards Salubi, and he is hit immediately. Blitz and down about five yards of end zone to work with here. Look out, almost blocked over the top, and a good kick. Brown will be dropped down. They've lost the ball and had to punt. And now they've made a change. Now they go to the I formation. Skinner down the middle of the field into coverage, and here goes a flag. Pitch to Brandon Pendergrass. Quickly out of the backfield. 
right at the first down marker. That's just the middle there. And Skinner, nice job. Look at the elusiveness that's You know, it's okay, men, to admit that you cried during that movie as Wake tries to get on the first down. And this time. Quick hitter with a fullback win. A lot of direction, and Brown gets the handoff. And they go to the fullback for the touchdown. The first touchdown for the Demon Deacons. And the PAT is tacked on between the Big 12 and the ACC. We have a very special guest in the booth we'll introduce here in just a moment. College team in the country, uh, 1995, when we had several really sad situations where we had a literal game fights. And so after the scramble by Griffin and the penalty, it's second and nine, and Griffin eluding some serious rush. And you get a look at some of the speed. Griffin in trouble, and he will not get anywhere near the first down. Loses a yard, and the Bears will have to punt. Wake Forest has actually made some really good adjustments since the first uh, drive of the game. Hunter Haynes on the stop there. A jet also there for the Demon Deacons. You take a good look at Art Wiles. What do you think of the job he's done at Baylor? He's done a terrific job. He's a, he's a great person as well as an outstanding football coach. He's recruited well. Uh, he has them ready to play, and uh, it's a new day for Baylor. And instead of punting, it looks like unless Griffin may drop back and boot this himself on fourth and three. Let's see what happens. Pooch game. Pretty good one. He's a great athlete. Really good one. Inside the five. And that went without incident. And Wake Forest has shifted. And when coaches seek jobs while they have jobs, sometimes they really get ripped. As here's an opportunity here for And it is a first down. That comes about, and it has to be handled by the coach and the administration that he works with to increase the knowledge so that when our minority coaches get the opportunity. Uh-oh. Hold your time up here. Number 72, offense. For naught for the Wake Forest faithful. Second and 17, but they continue to run the ball and getting some. And Skinner's fifth attempt is going to lead to a first down. Now it's bad to see Skinner air it out some more. Ball start, 83. Skinner, he's been sacked a couple of times. He's got some room, and he'll take it. Longtime Duke point guard Greg Paul has made his quarterbacking debut for Syracuse. Pretty good, except for the interception overtime at Minnesota wins. And Wake Forest. Out of the flat, caught. That is Salubi getting some good downfield blocking. Holy. Tim on the offense. It's the tailback. The penalty marked to the spot of the foul. Griffin taking the deep shot to the end zone. Has a chance, and the pass was a little bit underthrown. Tunnel screen, and that's going to get a one to the right this time, and very aggressive coverage. Kind of an ugly looking line drive, and that's exactly what will happen. The way that first half played out, but just weren't able to take advantage of all the situations. Deep kickoff, and Chris Gibbons is going to run it out from about six yards deep in his end zone. And it was Brown in motion. And he winds up with a football. Screen here to Gibbons, and Baylor read that promptly. Blitz coming from the edge. Skinner stepped up nicely, but Pavelic with the interception. This is Griffin on that pitch back to Kendall Wright. Stutter step, what a sweet move! Right up the middle, he's going to score! points off of turnovers. Baylor has converted it. Another nice kickoff. This will be Gibbons again. A couple of yards deep. Pressure coming from the backside and he is brought down. And trying to get the run game going again. Straight ahead. Skinner. Right at the marker, and it will be a first. Here comes a little blitz. Skinner gets rid of it in time. And a minimal. Holding left this time. Skinner 
But nice poise that time to find the open man and get it close to a weak mistake. This will be Givens again, and he'll have a first down this time. Ball start, 70 offense. Force do with this double wing and give you stuff you're not prepared for. Nice move by Josh Adam for the Demon Deacons. And Skinner missed a man to his left. The blitz was picked up nicely. The receive for Baylor kind of in the shadows and sunlight. Might be tricky for him if it's a high kick and it isn't. Came out funny. Off the foot of Shane Popham. Can he get to the outside and use that world-class speed? That is just dropped. Is that incomplete? If he gets to the edge here, he's got it. He's in a little trouble here, though. Gets out of it and gets through to the first down. It's Justin Akers. Remember, kids, he's a sophomore, and he's barely 19 years old. Here's Jay Finley at the tailback spot. Live up to it. Looked left, took off, slides, getting into position to perhaps score again. How about a double pass? One's a lateral, one's a pass, and one is a touchdown! Spread. They've got to start throwing the ball. Right down the fairway. Compared to Riley Skinner, we talked about the quarterback battle before the game. His possessions was a one-play kneel down. Skinner. That's going to be complete for a game. Skinner under some pressure, he'll dump it off. That's Brown again, and he will find a nice hole. Good run there. A little pressure from the edge, and that's going to be... Baylor turnovers. This year, Baylor scores 10 points off of... And Skinner. Is he inbounds? Yes. Back to the ground, a little hole here. That's Brown. That's Red Fred in the fullback position. He gets in a block, and Brown tries to get to the corner. And he is that opens up the running game for him. Has a little time. Now it goes right away. Wow. Pressure from the edge. Skinner stepped away from it, recognized it, and got off a nice throw. Under great pressure. Oh, what a throw! Touchdown, Wake Forest! Tracy Robertson. Not an easy guy to get around in this game. That's Geddes at the three. And a wedge and a little room up the middle. And Geddes at the 35. Shoved out of bounds. Griffin hit as he throws wide open. Will it work? No. Might be a little big for those young men. There's a big hole. Whistle. Full start. 14. BBT and field nearby there. Baylor up by 10. And a little running room here for Kendall Wright. Ganaway. And he. That is Finley. I had nine guys back. Straight ahead with Griffin. Griffin, great work, got a nice block too, and he'll get it down to the 10-yard line. And it doesn't work. Plenty of time, darts it to the end zone, incomplete. That's going to be too high, fourth down. And you hear the noise, that kick is blocked. Skinner, I don't know how he got out of that. Just throws it away. Personal foul. Rough in the passer. 97. You saw that, right? Yeah. A lot of pressure again. Skinner fires it off. USC true freshman quarterback Matt Barkley has thrown for 230 yards and his first career touchdown pass. Again, a blitz. Picked up nicely. That's going to be a first down and a little bit more. We stepped into that ball. Good long throw out there. Now they're starting to get into a rhythm offense. Skinner again, about the same area. That's going to be a first down. Down by 10, naturally they're going to be throwing the ball more. We'll go out to that side again. Look out. Presented by Pennzoil. Coverage begins tomorrow at 7 Eastern in ESPN with NASCAR countdown. And there's an immediate hit. 
Skinner down the middle. And it is intercepted on the deflection. And almost to the 10 yard line. Flag coming in. The ball that had to be caught. Face mask against Wake. Need a big turnover here. And Finley worked really hard. And some good running in traffic. Get it out in space to Kendall Wright. And it's Griffin hanging on to it this time. And look out there. Their defensive coordinator for a call. Let's him the edge. Griffin escapes from one, but not from two other. Wake defenders. The ball is on the ground. They need some points. Instead, they'll keep it on the ground. And it's going to work. Pocket collapsing around Skinner, and he throws that one toward the band. Personal foul. Contact to the helmet. 88 defense. Didn't do that. A lot of motion, a lot of confusion, and a couple of extra. Into a crowded end zone. Caught in the back of the end zone. It is touchdown. Never sees him coming. A very important PAT each minutes ago. This place was quiet as Baylor had the ball. Now it's erupted with Wake Forest getting to within three. And great spirited coverage that time. Personal foul. Number two. They learned how to win. Well, Finley thinks so. The clock keeps moving. Finley again up the middle. Finley breaks the tackle. Finley gets a first down. Taylor is in the backfield. And they'll follow right behind him. Look. And Griffin will keep. And this time. Dart to run. And if not, then throw it. He does throw it. And it's going to be incomplete. Right around the 13-yard line. Low kick. And actually checked up. And that's bounced all over. He had a lot of juice on that. And it's going to be poor field position. Skinner. Short arm. Almost. Got to get rid of it. And Skinner. I think he was already down. This is probably the biggest win that Art Bryles has had in his this second season. 